Hey guys, it's Naya, and today I have a drugstore haul for you guys. I know I already uploaded one yesterday, or I think it was the day before yesterday, I'm not sure. But, um, I have another one for you, because I got some money, and I felt like spinning it and buying some more makeup. So, I got all my stuff from Walmart, and I, my total was, out of everything, it was thirteen eighty-two. Um, so I'm going to start with my e.l.f. stuff. So, I got three things from e.l.f. And the first thing I got, well, the first two things I got were a pair of natural false eyelashes. And, um, here's what they both look like. I have the same type. What they look like. And they're just, they both say natural. And it comes with a glue. And the lashes. I love these lashes because they flare outwards and they're a lot thinner. They're not all like dramatic and stuff. Um, these are actually my first pair of false lashes. I'm really nervous because I don't want to apply them wrong or anything. And I'm sorry if the light changes. It's getting darker outside. I'm using like my um, room light. But yeah. Um, and I hope this glue is really good because I plan on wearing these to school soon for a special occasion. But yeah, these were both... Um, one dollar each. The next thing I got from e.l.f. was um, their 99 cent, well, one dollar um, automatic, oh, yeah, uh, mechanical eyelash curler. Um, I've owned one of these before, but um, it got lost, or I think it got broken. I'm not sure, but I owned one of these two years ago, and I don't know where it is. And I've moved and everything, so I really don't know where it is. Um, and... I'm going to open it for you guys. It says new on it, but these have been out for years. So, don't believe it when it says new. I guess it just means it's new in the store, but yeah. So, it comes like this. It comes with a little band on it to protect it from, like, um, you know, just so it will be able to fit in your purse or wherever you're going to take it. I guess it's just for traveling reasons. But, um, it comes with a little thing, and it already comes with a rubber thing on it. And it also comes with a extra rubber thing rubbery thing. I don't know what they're called, but I'm just going to call them rubber applicators. But this was one dollar. And I was really excited because I was going to get one from Sephora in a few days because I plan on going to the mall probably this weekend. And I was like, oh, I'm just going to buy one from Sephora. And I'm like, it's a little expensive. Now that I saw this, I'm like, deal. Had me sold. The next thing I got is this are some nail polishes and I'm obsessed with nail polishes now. I used to hate buying nail polish but I love it. I'm going to show you the one I got from Wet n Wild and it's their Wet Shine, Wild Shine sorry, nail polish and it's in the color Sunny Side and you guys know it's, probably, it's just an orange. It's more like a pastel orange color. That's what it looks like. It's very, it's, it'll come out like this pink. Yeah, it, it, it'll have the same finish as this pink nail polish. And this is Wet n Wild's um, Tickled Pink. But these will have the same finish. And I love these nail polishes. They're amazing. And I needed an orange color because I already have a coral one. And I'm in love with their nail polishes now. Just for spring, they have bright colors out now. And they're amazing. The next one I got... It, the next ones I got are from NYC New York Colors. And they're their long wear um, nail enamel nail polishes. I got 151 Skyline Blue, and it's just a pastel blue. I've been looking for one for really cheap for a long time, and I haven't found one. So when I found this one, um, I was really excited. One downfall about it, it has these, it has like the glitters in it. I don't know if you guys can see. Yeah, you can probably see it now, like there. It has these sparkles in it, and you won't have to put, like I love putting glitter nail polish on my, like, um, matte nail polishes. Well, matte looking nail polishes. And I'm surprised that it already comes with sparkle in it. I'm like, oh my god. It had me sold when it, I just saw that it was a pastel blue with glitter in it. it. It's so pretty. And you guys should definitely check out this color. It's amazing. Once again, that's 151 Skyline Blue. Next one I got is, um, I love it. I love it. I'm in love with this. Um, this is, um, 105 Starry Silver Glitter. This is beautiful. I saw something like this at Sephora. Um, I can't remember what it was called, but I saw something very similar to this at Sephora. And 
it has these like blue, like teal blue, um, purpley and silver glitter in it. Let me show you. That's what the glitters look like. Really pretty. This would be so pretty on prom. And my sister is probably going to wear this for her prom nail polish because it's not my prom yet. I have like three, two more years. I might go early, but um, I might go senior year. Um, she might wear this because she has a teal dress. I'm like, this is, this will look so pretty on her on her nails for her prom. I'm like, uh, it'll it'll fit us both. <laughs> so that was those were only those nail polish I showed you were all 99 cents. And this one was 99 cents too. I was running out of the um, Revlon. I think it's Revlon Color Stay nail polish. I'm not sure if it was the Color Stay line, but it was their um, Quick Dry Top Coat. I was running out of that, and I got the NYC 271 Extra Shiny Top Coat. Nothing special, just a top coat. And I'm hoping this won't help anything chip faster. I hope this will help it last longer. The next thing I got was the most expensive purchase in my entire buy. Um, I got my first, Mil like, well, actually, this is probably my third Milani product. Um, I got the Milani um, Eye Tech Bolt Liquid Eyeliner Pen. And that's a picture of what it would what it could do. And that's the actual pen tip. And it's in number one black. And I'm gonna open it for you guys. This was $5.99. I thought it was two dollars because someone put some stupid person put it like in the section where it's also some stupid person put it in like the two ninety nine area and I didn't really read it. So this is what the pen looks like. It's so chunky. Some of those chunky pens. I'm gonna do swatches. Oh, that's nice. That's awesome. It's actually not as black, though. It's more of a toned down black. It's not, I guess, because it doesn't say um, extra black, but it does make tips. I'm gonna try to draw like a line with a wing. Yeah, it makes really nice wings. And I hope this lasts me a long time. So it just snaps back on. It's really nice. Um, and that's an overview of what it looks like. And it comes with um, 0.8 flu fluid ounces and 2.5 milliliters. Um, the next, the last thing I got. Um, you guys know in my last um, drugstore haul, I showed you a hair dye. I tried to dye my hair with it, and because my hair is naturally black, um, it didn't really show up, obviously. So um, I'm going to try to bleach my hair, and I'm going to use the Revlon Number no. 70 Medium Ash Blonde um, Color Silk Beautiful Color Hair Dye. Um, I hope, I pray that this will work because I want ombre hair so bad and I already saw some videos on YouTube people with black hair the hair color or dark dark brown hair um, using ash blonde hair dye or just ombre hair dye in general they use this and it just didn't turn it didn't turn out this blonde but it turned out a nice light color towards the bottom so I'm gonna try this and if this doesn't work I'm gonna go for the L'Oreal I think it is the L'Oreal hair dye the the one with the like girl with the ombre hair on it already, I'm going to try that next. So if this doesn't work, epic fail, but I'll definitely show you guys that in another video with my ombre hair. That'll probably be my next video, ombre hair. So yeah, I hope this works. And this was um, $3. $3. So yeah, guys, that was my drugstore makeup haul, drugstore haul in general. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, if you like videos like this, please like and thumbs up this video. If you want to review on any of the stuff that I showed you in this video, please ask me in the comments. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Once again, please comment and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye!